Tonight, security experts are warning you to protect your private information. This after a major data breach at AT&T over the weekend. We could on reporter Maddie McCaffrey joins us live now to tell you what you need to know. Nikel, right now, AT&T is working on notifying those customers who were impacted by this massive data breach. And even if you weren't notified about being affected by the breach, it's still very important to look into this hack to make sure that your personal information is safe. This is quite a serious issue. Experts say past and present AT&T users should act now to protect their data. The company says it's investigating how information from 73 million customers got onto the dark web. AT&T says it's now notifying those affected. You get a letter like that in the mail from someone that you have entered into a contract with. You need to take time to read the letter. If you're not notified, just don't assume automatically that you're safe. You need to investigate this. The breach appears to involve data from 2019 or earlier. It could include names, passwords, social security numbers, birth dates, and more. Once a bad guy has that, a criminal has that information, perhaps they could pose as you and call up one of your bank accounts or health accounts. This former NSA general counsel says if you think you've been hacked, one, reset your password, to ask a credit reporting agency to put a fraud alert on your account, and three, consider a credit freeze to block someone from opening a credit card in your name. Any hacker who is, who is both skilled enough and lucky enough to get inside a telecom company is going to find a digital treasure chest. And right now, AT&T is working to get to the bottom of what exactly caused this massive data breach. And in the meantime, if you weren't notified of being affected, it's a good idea to just make sure that your personal information is secure and to change your passwords. I'm reporting live, bringing coverage you can count on. Maddie McCaffrey, Way 31 News.